But usually this time of year, Cardinals pitchers and catchers start heading down to Jupiter, Florida for their report date around mid-February. But with the lockout showing no signs of a resolution, fans and players are left wondering what's next. We know a deal for a new labor agreement will eventually happen, but that's the issue. We don't know when it will happen. How long it takes will greatly affect spring training and possibly the regular season. It's encouraging that the two sides met Monday and Tuesday, but they're still reportedly not seeing eye to eye on several key issues such as revenue sharing and arbitration. I spoke to Katie Wu of The Athletic today and she pointed out that even when an agreement is finally made, there will need to be a lot of things accomplished before the season can start. Once a deal is in place, all 30 teams will then have to navigate a frenzy of a very shortened off season. There will be signings that will need to be made, roster acquisitions, whether that's trades or free agent signings. They'll have to deal with arbitration, which is normally an off season process, process anyway. And then there, of course, there's the regular visas for all of their players that are out of the country and COVID-19 intake testing. So it really doesn't leave a lot of time. Then uh, these negotiations will have to get hammered out pretty quickly. No one really knows if that is a feasible ask.